It doesn't really matter if you're five, 35, or 50 years old. Protein is an extremely important part of the human body. Protein is a compound consisting of large molecules, an essential part of our health overall. And if you are experiencing a protein deficiency, you might be seeing your hair fall off, problems with muscle structure, lack of collagen, wrinkles, premature aging, and much more. In a couple words, a true disaster that needs fixing right away. So in today's video, I'm gonna reveal six signs of a protein deficiency you might be experiencing daily and how to fix it naturally and effectively. Hey guys, Dr. Gus here, naturopath, acupuncturist, conventional doctor, and founder of DrLandivar.com. In this channel as a conventional doctor to my patients through natural medicine before recurring to the use of pharmaceutical drugs. So if you're new to my channel, consider subscribing and press that bell down below to see notifications and be the first one to watch a new video. If you need a lot of point of quality supplements for your disease, visit DrLandivar.com and stay till the end of this video, I'm gonna share some tips and video links related to this topic. You have to think of proteins as the building blocks of your entire body. They are present in many foods that you eat and can help boost your metabolism or fat burning potential. Your vital organs, your muscles, tissues, and even some hormones of the human body are made from proteins. This is one of the reasons why if you have a protein deficiency, you can end up destroying your entire system in more ways than you normally would imagine. Simply put, without proteins in your life, you would not exist. And this is why it's so important for you to avoid any type of protein deficiency that you might be having. So in today's video, I'll reveal six signs that you have a protein deficiency and you might be experiencing it daily and how to fix it naturally and effectively. Number one, your hair, skin, and nails do not look healthy. Connective tissue, as it's called, meaning everything that composes your skin, your hair, your nails, etc., are mainly mostly out of protein. This protein is what usually forms that famous collagen and elastin everybody is buying at the supermarket today. It's the same collagen that keeps your skin tight, beautiful, and looking young. And now, the problem with having a lack of proteins is that obviously your body in fact, does not have enough collagen able to form all this tissue I'm just talking about. When your diet is lacking certain amino acid, it becomes harder for your body to repair the wounds you may have, keep your skin youthful in texture, and even maintain that hair thickness that everybody wants. Now, if you pay close attention, this is what we tend to see in people who go on extreme diets all the time. After a couple of years of being on diets, this excessive reduction of protein consumption and whatever they're doing causes their skin to sag, their hair to fall, and their nails to brittle. So if you need something natural that you can use to improve your hair, your skin, your nails, you need protein. Apart from that, you can try maybe a supplement form that has everything you need for your hair, skin, and nails to look the way you want it. So look for HSN factors at drlandivar.com. Number two, high cholesterol. I've seen how people feel surprised when they go or they receive their lab test and they come out with high cholesterol. For some, their first impression is, why do I have a high cholesterol level if all I do is eat healthy? I eat lots of vegetables, lots of fruit, and hardly any meat. Well, that's a problem. High cholesterol and triglycerides are not just caused by eating fatty foods. They're also a result of low protein consumption, an increased inflammation, hormonal imbalances, and high processed or high sugar diets. If you tend to replace protein, foods maybe that are meats, healthy meats, with sugary snacks, carbs, packaged goods, obviously you will see cholesterol rise or start to rise in your body. This dietary combination obviously makes your liver and your cells process fats less efficiently. Some studies have shown and even found how there's an inverse relationship between protein intake, what you eat, and the risk for heart disease. And many people find it surprising, but it's true. And as a matter of fact, this is sometimes why the keto diet is so effective at reducing cholesterol. Think about it. Protein and good fat doesn't necessarily mean you will have high cholesterol. It's exactly the opposite. So you have to be careful what you practice or what you eat or how you do your diet, because sometimes you think that might be the solution, but that's the problem. Number three, brain fog. Believe it or not, this is a real problem these days. Feeling brain foggy or fog is something extremely common, and many medical doctors don't know how to solve this in their patients. 
Most people don't know that protein is needed to support many aspects of our health, our neurological function. So for example, brain fog, poor concentration, maybe the lack of motivation or you know, trouble learning every day can be all signs that you have low neurotransmitters that come from protein consumption. Some of these include, for example, dopamine, norepinephrine, epinephrine, or even serotonin, all made by our body when there's enough protein around. This is why you might see also that so many studies are supporting the fact that eating healthy proteins like fish, even turkey or poultry, can boost mental clarity and function. Neurotransmitters in general are synthesized in the brain using amino acids that come from proteins. And this means obviously that you're not, maybe not eating enough protein, the, ones you, the, the amount you need. Studies show that a balanced diet with healthy meats, poultry, chicken, etc. can easily boost work performance, learning, and motor skills. And this is true. And this is why sometimes brain fog might become a problem. You need to look at your diet and see what you're eating. Maybe you're not eating enough protein. Maybe, maybe you're eating too much wheat. Maybe too many carbs. All this plays a role in brain fog also. If you need something naturally effective that has the power to reduce inflammation and brain fog, which by the way can many times start in your gut. Look for GI Balance and Kirk you Health from Fineland at DrLendivar.com. Number four, you might be overweight. Believe it or not, lots of research today is now supporting the fact that diets that are low in protein could be responsible for weight gain. When protein, for example, becomes deficient, the human body looks for other sources of energy and most of the times this leads to an increased consumption of other type of foods that will make you fat. What happens is that protein is satisfying. When you're not eating protein, you're actually craving maybe carbs, sweets, and foods that you should not take as a priority. By the way, dietitians know that high protein foods cause an increased society or feeling of, you know, feeling okay without having that anxiety to eat. Once again, this is why sometimes the keto diets everybody uses today are so effective. So what more can you ask for? You will have more muscle, less fat, and no weight gain. Number five, you may not be sleeping well. What on earth does insomnia have to do with the lack of protein? You see, poor sleep and insomnia can many times be linked to unstable blood sugar levels, a rise in cortisol, or a decrease in serotonin production. What you wouldn't believe is how many people suffer from sleep problems due to poor protein consumption every day. Take turkey meat, for example. Turkey helps your body produce tryptophan, a precursor to melatonin or serotonin for a good night's rest. On the other hand, carbohydrates require much more insulin to be metabolized than fat or protein. So this means obviously that eating foods that are high in protein before bed can actually help you with tryptophan production and serotonin production and then melatonin formation. By the way, turkey, poultry, and fish are the best to eat before going to bed. They really help. You might try it. You might want to try it. If you need something natural and effective against insomnia that has everything you need for proper rest and sleep, look for Quantum Calm, Melatonin, and 5-HTP from Finland at DrLendivar.com. And how about this channel? I give you this video a thumbs up and share it with your friends and family. If you have any questions, leave your comments down below and I'll be happy to assist you. If you need quality supplements for your disease or align an appointment, visit DrLendivar.com and check out these other videos with you to stop you from information that might prevent a serious health condition in the future. Thanks for watching you guys and I'll see you soon.